Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome on back to another reaction video. If you have no idea who I am, my name is Sam, aka OGB Reacts. I'm a first time movie reactor here on YouTube, posting every Friday. The movie that I'm watching for this video is one of those films where I've heard a lot about it in the way that it is good and well done and a movie that I should watch, but I have no idea what it's about. I don't know the plot. I don't know anything. The movie that I'm watching for this video is Mulholland Drive from 2001. I have heard of it before, but don't know anything besides that. <laughs> So of course I am excited to watch and I hope that you guys are excited to watch the reaction. With that, if you're here watching right now, I really do appreciate you and thank you for watching. And to everybody over on Patreon, I really do appreciate you over there as well. Thank you so much for being there. Thank you so much for your support. And I hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reaction videos, the access to the polls, and access to other reactions that aren't yet cut for YouTube. If you want to watch the full unedited version of this video or to anything else on my channel, you can absolutely do so over on my Patreon. It is $5 a month for that. I also have a tier over there that is solely for the polls, which are ran every single Friday, and that is $2 a month for that. I also have a free trial available over on Patreon if you would like to take a crack at watching these full reactions for yourself. So yeah, don't know what I'm getting into, don't know what to expect, have no idea what's going to happen, but again, I'm excited to watch, and I hope that you guys are too. With that, really do hope that you guys like this reaction, and I shall see you on the other side. Enjoy. Now, I was told by someone that basically to watch the film, even if I don't, like, understand exactly what's going on. Like, just watch the scenes and it will all connect at some point. Like, no matter how strange or out of place it is, just watch and retain and, you know, don't question it too much. Okay. So just by reading that, I feel like this might be a trippy time. <laughs> I mean, it already seems trippy, so. <laughs> Mulholland Drive. See, starting a movie in a car, you know, is like never good. Like, you know what I mean? I feel like something bad is gonna happen. What are you doing? We don't stop here. What I what I say? What I just say? <laughs> oh boy. Oh Get out boy. Of the car. What did I just say? Oh, Jesus. All right, well, at least someone, like one person is dead, right? Like definitely. Cause those people were like hanging out of the car on the top and stuff. Like they're definitely, they got flung, definitely. Damn. You know, you, you came out of there relatively unscathed, it seems. So that's kind of crazy. Oh, okay. We got a little blood on the head. Oh, well, that might not be too good. Oh, okay. Goodbye. I'm surprised the other car didn't even stop. <laughs> and she got hit again. Round two. <laughs> Could be someone's missing, maybe. Hmm. Should I'm thinking. <laughs> Don't be suspicious. You know, I'd probably wait until they're gone, but oh. Yeah, so uh I don't think she knows this woman that she just <laughs> she just went in her house. All right. And clearly she won't be back for a little bit. I had a dream about this place. There's a man in back of this place. He's the one who's doing it. I can see him through the wall. I can see his face. Trippy ass dream. I hope that I never see that face ever outside of a dream. I have a feeling you will. Music, huh? Oh God, is it gonna like peek around the corner or something? Oh! 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 
Jesus Christ. Oh. I knew it. Oh, yeah, get back around that corner. Damn, scared the shit out of me. Fuck. Hated that. Hated every second of that. Thank you so much. The girl is still missing. Okay, again. Apparently, every scene, everything that happens, it might not make sense now. But yeah, okay, that definitely was a scene that did not make sense right now, but probably will soon. <laughs> it's time to say goodbye, Betty. Betty, it was so nice meeting you. All the luck in the world. Thank you. Oh. Bye. Bye. How oh, nice. <laughs> The smiles on their faces. Huh, interesting. I think they're the old people from the very beginning when the dancing was happening, right? So happy. You and your aunt probably have an understanding, so here's the key. And if ah. you need anything, just give a holler. Okay. You know, ever since that jump scare happened, I am now uneasy. <laughs> just like with the camera movements and everything. Oh, this is the same place in which that girl ran, like, from the car crash? Oh! Oh! Oh my! Uh -oh. I'm sorry, my Aunt Ruth didn't tell me someone was gonna be here. There was an accident. I came here. What's your name? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Does she remember her name? You know, she's still smiling, happy giddy. Like, she's like, oh, that's fine. Random woman is here. That's okay. My name's Rita. Oh, Hi. Uh -huh. She's letting me stay here while she's working on a movie that's being made in Canada. But I guess you already know that. <sighs> sure. <laughs> oh, uh-oh. Bro, you gotta go to the hospital. You got some head damage. Well, where were you hurt? If you have a concussion, you shouldn't sleep. It'll be okay if I sleep. Um, well, she slept like twice already, so. Yeah, very, very curious to know what her story is. You're in the process of recasting your lead actress. We are asking you to keep an open mind. Okay. So serious. <laughs> Okay. May I offer you gentlemen anything? Espresso. Nothing. Uh, what's the photo for? I think you're going to enjoy your espresso this time. I've done quite a bit of research, knowing how hard you are to please. This one comes highly recommended. What's the photo for? Oh, it's a recommendation. A recommendation to you, Adam. It's not a recommendation. This is the girl. There's no way! There's no way! Isn't that the guy that played uh, Dick in Dick that I just watched? <laughs> He's gonna hate it. Excuse me. God, this movie is doing such a good job at being like so unsettling in like the weirdest way, you know? That's how I feel right now. It's just like unsettled. <laughs> Dramatic. I'm sorry. That was a highly recommended. That is considered one of the finest espressos in the Wait world. What sir. is going on here? There is no way that girl is in my mouth. What? This is the girl. Hey, that girl is not in my film. It's no longer your film. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Wow. And then who the hell is this guy in, like, the chair here? Like, wow. I know, again, it's just like, everything's gonna make sense, but it's just, I'm still questioning it, of course. It's like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> I have to vocally express it. <laughs> Castigliani brothers? Beat it, pal. Uh-oh. Okay. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, he's so dead. This guy's dead. He's going to die. 
Good night. Rest in peace. Goodbye. Do you want us to shut everything down? Then we'll shut everything down. Oh, uh, okay. All right. What the hell? Hey, so that's, uh, that's it, huh? That's Ed's huh? famous black book. The history of the world in phone numbers. <gasps> okay. All right. Um. Oh. Shit. <gasps> Something bit me bad. Bit you? Okay. <laughs> Oh my god. Damn, you are messing this up. Uh, hey man, hey! And hey, she's hurt real bad. Could you come here and call on the phone, please? I need you. You have to kill him too. No! 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 Holy shit. And you're dead too. Hey man. Suck at this. Okay, Aunt Ruth, I'll try. He really, really blew at that. <laughs> oh, I got a real shock to find your friend Rita here. She was in the shower and I opened the door. Well... Rita! What do you mean? Uh huh? <laughs> oh, she was in an accident. I thought you knew my aunt and that's why you were here. I just talked to my aunt on the phone, and she wants me to call the police. I don't know who I am. What do you mean? You're Rita. No, yeah. I'm not. I had a feeling. I don't know what my name is. Your name must be in your purse. Okay. Well, that's nice. Where'd you get that from? Well, she won't know. Huh? What is that? They fired everyone. Who fired everyone? Yeah. Ray did. I wonder where you were going. Yeah, she literally doesn't remember Mulholland Drive. anything. Oh, Mulholland Drive. Okay. Now you've done it. Just forget you ever saw it. It's better at Billy Ray Cyrus. This guy looks like Johnny Knoxville. What too. the hell are you even doing here? What are you doing? That's my jewelry! Not anymore. <laughs> uh. What are you doing? Wow. Stop it! Stop it! Girl, you cheated on him. Slept in. <laughs> slept with some dude in your guys' bed. Oh, shit. Oh! Okay. Wild stuff. There's one. This was the same diner as the beginning when that guy was talking about his dream and that jump scare happened. Diane. I remember something. Diane Selwyn. Maybe that's my name. Huh. D. Selwyn. It's the only one. I'm gonna call. The waitress kinda, kinda looked like the picture that they had of the actress that wanted to be in the movie. Am I overthinking? Am I looking too much into it? Hello, it's me. Leave a message. That's not my voice. Yeah. Oh, wow, well, no. I know no. her. Huh. Maybe that's your roommate. Or if it is Diane Selwyn, she could tell you who you are. Adam Kesher! Yeah, right! Get lost! This is Adam Kesher's house! Uh, Get it out now! Get it out! Uh, Adam Kesher! Damn! 
Bro, what are you doing? I guess you don't understand English. She said leave. Here's a door. Yeah, I mean, this guy is a huge man. Oh! Oh my god. My girl, there is no way that you're going to take down that man. I'm sorry, Mr. Kesher, but there seems to be some problem with your credit cards. Oh, of course. What? Where you're hiding from? They know where you are. Wow, okay. Um... Do you know somebody called the cowboy? The cowboy? This guy, the cowboy, wants to see you. Jason said he thought it'd be a good idea. Oh, Jason thought it'd be a good idea for me to go see the cowboy. <laughs> or should I wear my 10-gallon hat and my six shooters? Oh, my so, God. Something tells me that this guy is connected to what's happening. Yeah, this is... This is it's wild. right about here. It's Sierra Bonita. It's not too far away. What's wrong with that? I'm not sure about this. Um, oh no. Hide, hide! Yes? May I help you? Someone is in trouble. Oh, hello. My name's Betty. No, it's not. That's huh? not what she said. What? Someone is in trouble. Something bad is happening. I'm sorry it happens sometimes. No. Come on. No, she said it was someone else who oh. was in trouble. Stop it, Louise. Oh, I'm taking you boy. home. I mean, Louise is not, you know, fibbing. <laughs> she knows something, definitely. <laughs> I believe her. <laughs> See, coming up here at night, you know, can we can we make it during the day? <laughs> Howdy. Howdy. I want you to go back to work tomorrow. When you see the girl that was shown to you earlier today, wow. you will say, this is the girl. Good night. This is wild. Like, what in the world? <laughs> and he's gone. Poof. Like, <laughs> the mysterious cryptid, the cowboy. <laughs> You're trying to blackmail me. It's not gonna work. You're playing a dangerous game here. <laughs> Such a lame scene. Both <laughs> you are really good. Oh, you know what? She's gonna be auditioning for the role they want that girl to... Or maybe not. Woody Katz, who we have cast in the part of Chuck, and will do the scene with you. Okay, never mind. I really thought it was going to be the same show. It's not a contest. Don't play it for real until it gets real. <laughs> Everyone's like, okay. <laughs> What's your name? Betty. Yeah, Betty. Look, you don't rush it. I don't rush it. Okay. Now we're gonna oh. play this nice and close, okay. just like in the movie. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Where's my flag? Hold on, I'm getting it. I don't like this. I don't like this. Don't like it. Don't like it. Oh, okay. He trusts you. You're his. Oh my god. I just didn't think that this scene would play out like this. <laughs> I'm gonna take her over there. Yeah, big time. God, that was awful. Oh. Not you, Betty. You were stellar, and I mean that. But poor Wally. He'll never get that picture made. No. Wally's days were up 20 years ago. Damn. Now, we want to take you across and introduce you to a director who's a head above the rest. He's got a project you will kill. Okay. Now she's probably going to be going to the set where that whole situation is happening. <laughs> you know what? I still stand by my red flag, though, of how that older man acted. You know what? Because that was just, ooh, <laughs> I'm comfy. 
Yep. Oh boy. Who's next, Hank? Uh, Camila Rhodes. Uh oh. Yep. 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 Story. Camila Rhodes, take one. Yeah, I am so curious about. Okay, here we go. Let's lock it up, please. This whole thing. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is the girl. Yep. Excellent choice. Hmm. Yep. Instant connections. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wow. <sighs> yeah. Well, you know, just her being there, she's now somehow involved. <laughs> Selwyn, number 12. They're in sync. Diane? I switched apartments with her. She's in 17. But she hasn't been around for a few days. I'll go with you. Uh, okay. Um. She's still got some of my stuff. I mean. You go ahead. I gotta get that. It's not like they have a key to the place, you know? Still has some of my stuff. What are you gonna do? Just take it? Like what? And break in, take it? I guess you're not Diane Selwyn. Guess I'm not. But that name, it appeared in her mind for a reason, so. Oh my god. Breaking and entering? Uh, yeah, I was literally just about to say, is someone dead in there? Uh-oh. Oh, I don't like this. Don't like this. Oh. Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. I know what you're doing. But let me do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's such a bad wig. <laughs> Good night, Betty. I'm sorry, I can't get over it. I'm sorry. You don't have to wear that in the house. What? I'm the, wig. <laughs> the wig. The wig. The wig. <laughs> and you don't have to sleep on that couch no it's okay no it's not this is a huge bed come on just get in and get a good night's sleep okay uh, <laughs> anyway <laughs> all right and suddenly boob it's boobs it's more comfortable than the couch isn't it <laughs> yes just girls hanging out, you know, just being girls, best friends, gal pals. Yes. You know, I was sensing it a little bit this entire movie. And look where we are now. Good for y'all. Good for y'all. Good, good for you. Wow. All right. Love women, loving women. Love it. <laughs> Always welcomed. <laughs> Silencio. No hay banda. Silencio. You know, she really needed to go to a hospital after she hit her noggin. Like, go with me somewhere. Oh, God. Okay. No. I feel like it's things are about to ramp up. <laughs> Is that Silencio? Yeah. No, I banda. This is all a tape recording. Huh. Oh, 
Okay, goodbye. Wow, all right. Oh! Like he said, it's all a recording. What the hell is this? Okay, the piece from earlier then that she had, what, what, where did the cube come from? <laughs> what? Betty? Where did Betty go? Betty? I'm not trying to jump to conclusions here. Is Betty an illusion? Am I, am I, what do I, hmm. Yeah, what is this puzzle going on here? Uh. What in the world? What? Oh boy. Hey, pretty girl. Oh no. Oh, the, the cowboy. Oh, <laughs> okay. Um. Okay, and now we're looking at Camila. Where have you been? What do you want? My lamp and dishes? That's my ashtray. Take it. She's in the same house as, but that's, but this, um. Oh, by the way, those two detectives came by again looking for you. Two detectives? What? You've come back. What the fuck is going on? Wait. Uh, uh. Okay. <laughs> I've tried so hard. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Okay. Um... Hello. Oh, okay. The ashtray is back. I shouldn't do this anymore. It's him, isn't it? I'm not trying to show you how to do the scene, but just... There's no break. Hmm. Damn. I'm just trying to watch before I try to figure this out. It's not easy for me! Diane! <laughs> oh, okay. Just a little sad jack off then? All right, cool. <laughs> Because this is the house in which that dead body was found and they found it. Was it her then? But she called her Camilla? Diane? Camilla. Camilla, Diane, yeah. Diane, the car is waiting. It's 6980 Mulholland Drive. Mulholland Drive. Oh, this is, this is wild, wild stuff. Cause... What are you doing? We don't stop here. Right. 
But this was her and the... A surprise. Shortcut. Okay. I'm getting anxious. I'm getting a little nervous because, like, I am so dumbfounded with so many things. Oh, damn, Camilla. You a bit manipulative and crazy and st Oh, boy. Here's to love. Ah. Huh. She is. She's nasty. Dragging her along to see this. Ah, here she is. Oh! Miss Ma'am, what are you doing here? I don't believe you met my mother. Hi. I'm Diane Selwyn. Oh, there's the connection. All right. Did not expect that. Wow. This is so... Again, I'm just, I'm just, I'm literally just like in super hyper focus mode. I couldn't believe it. I wanted to buy that judge a Rolls Royce. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Seeing some connections. What? Oh, no, what? Okay. All right. What is what? All right. <laughs> oh, the cowboy. <laughs> Camila and I are going to be. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Huh. This is so trippy. <laughs> oh my god. Because her name was Diane. Girl. Oh, yep. You got the money? Yep. You sure you want this? More than anything in this world. When it's finished, you'll find this where I told you. Underneath the ashtray, which they showed before, that key, okay, and then this guy, okay. What's it open? <laughs> oh boy, what in the world? Oh god, okay, and we're back here, all right. What, I don't, the jump scare. She has the cube, or whoever has the cube. I thought, I don't. What the hell? Am I on like some weird drug trip? Like what the hell? <laughs> explains that yep yeah you know we're getting explanations of things like somewhat but you know what not so much <laughs> Don't end here. Please don't end here. Oh my god, it ended there. Okay. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh god, I am going to have such a field day trying to figure this out fully. You know... I am trying my hardest <laughs> to figure out what exactly just 
fully happened. Because like I just said towards the end, you got got some answers, or as clear as of an, of an answer as we're possibly going to get from this movie, clearly. But there are definitely things that I'm so unsure of fully. Betty and Diane ended up looking very, very similar, and I'm just, like, wondering if they're somehow, in some way, shape, or form, the same person? Like, I don't, you know? And the whole thing with the two old people, like, haunting her, basically? Like, I'm I'm pretty sure those two old people are the, the people from the airport when Betty landed in Los Angeles, but... If Betty and Diane are like the same person somehow, some way, then like they th that makes sense that the old people would be like with Diane, but I don't understand why. Like clearly, it was like an illusion, right? I know that, but like, why would they be like haunting her? Was I guess Diane was like on drugs or something, and she was hardcore like hallucinating or something and then ended up you know killing herself and but it's just like why why the old people why are the old people being so small and coming into her house and haunting her why why i'm so like dumbfounded and i j all i want to do is just look up an explanation and i'm going to do that actually <laughs> but first i just wanted to express my dumbfoundedness of everything of just so many crazy things and wild things happening and there's no clear-cut answer and I'm just so curious as to like what the actual fuck actually happened you know <laughs> clearly Camila pretty manipulative not a great person you know strung Diane along and broke her to the point of which she hired that you know hitman to kill Camila, and which was unsuccessful, clearly. So Diane ended up killing herself. Camila is alive, question mark? Because she looked in the magical cube and then just, like, disappeared? Like, that's also really confusing. A lot of crazy things. A lot of just, like, vague, not crystal clear things happened. And I don't know if it's just like, oh, up for interpretation, totally up to you now. Or if it was, it's literally like, oh, there is an explanation, but just dive deeper, you know? Don't know if Betty existed literally at all. So that's, that's interesting. And the whole thing with like the sketchy people of trying to hire Camilla, who looked like Diane. Now that's another thing. The whole name switching and everything that's crazy to me like what like the person at the diner who was originally named diane and then that's how camilla was like oh diane i know that name i know this last name and then that's they went from there but then we looked towards the end when they were at the diner again and her name was betty so it's like the name switching there and the name switching with the fact that camilla was a blonde the, the girl who was actually diane oh my god i'm so oh and then <laughs> person who we didn't know her name is actually Camilla. A lot of name switching. A lot of like name back and forth and that's a, a definite source of my dumbfoundedness, confusion, etc. as well. This is definitely not a film where you're going to get it <laughs> the first time around. So here I am not getting it the first time around. I, I know when I edit this there's definitely gonna be th more things that like you know come to light and just like that I realize because I'm watching it for a second time technically you know but still this was wild and I am going to actually go ahead and now read and look up the background because I and I usually do that after I record but I just I really want to do it like right now a few moments later well after reading an explanation that kind of helped but not really <laughs> It's weird because, like, I get it, but, like, I don't, you know? And I think that's how a lot of people probably feel with this movie. The one thing that I did read that was, like, the biggest thing that I read was that, yes, it was confirmed that basically Diane and Betty are the same person. But it's like, 
you know, dream and reality. And it's, that's a whole thing to dive into. And like, again, I get it, but I don't. And there were other things that even weren't explained in it. I only read one like explanation of it, like a somewhat in-depth explanation of it, because I'm not going to sit here and read every explanation of it. I just wanted to kind of read something to gather my bearings a little bit more but it didn't fully help anyway so <laughs> also I said it earlier in this ending explanation but the same person played Betty and Diane and like my brain just really thought it was two separate actresses even though there was so much like overlap with how they looked I was just like no this this is a different person so like even up until the very end I was just like no, no, this is two different actresses. This is two different people. Nope, nope, that's that's the same person. <laughs> I think genuinely, even without reading the explanation that I found, I understand to an extent. <laughs> uh, there are definitely things where I'm still like, why? Or like, how? Or is this actually real? Um, so definitely curious about those specific things. Uh, and always... I'm excited to see, like, what you guys comment and stuff. For those of you who are watching, uh, please, you know, feel free to leave your explanations in the comments, etc. Because <laughs> this was a trippy as hell movie. And it was so suspenseful and you were on edge the literally the entire time. At least I was. Like, I was just tense the entire time because it was so unsettling just like the 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 silences that happen the the camera angles the music occasionally the interactions between people and just like the conversations that were being had and everything it was just so like you know like you, I was just tense like what is happening like this is very odd and mysterious and it really went for it with throughout this entire movie uh, and for that, it it is a well done movie in that way. Uh, and definitely, I think it is well done overall too because it just is just such an odd film. <laughs> At least just like how it's set up and how it's everything is just played out and the things that just happen. It's odd. It's weird. It's wild, and it doesn't fully answer everything, and it makes you like think. And that's where I'm at. I'm at the thinking stage. <laughs> and I've been at the thinking stage <laughs> for like the last half of the movie anyway. So I enjoyed this overall, but I am still confused, of course. I mean, I think that's just a given. Uh, and just kind of like, not necessarily overwhelmed, but just trying to figure it out, you know? Because a lot happened. <laughs> a lot happened and it was strange. But I did enjoy myself. And I hope that you guys enjoyed the reaction. <laughs> There are definitely more things that I can talk about, but I am still in such a state of like trying to think and understand that I'm gonna just gonna go back and forth. So if you did enjoy the video, please feel free to like it. And if you aren't already, please feel free to subscribe. And of course, if you want to watch the full unedited version of this video or to anything else on my channel, you can absolutely do so over on my Patreon. It is $5 a month for that. And to those of you who are already on Patreon, I really do appreciate you over there. Thank you so much for being there. Thank you so much for your support. And I hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reaction videos, the access to the polls, and access to other reactions that aren't yet cut for YouTube. If you want to find me outside of YouTube, you can absolutely do so. You can find me pretty much anywhere at OGB Reacts. I'm mainly over on Twitter, but I'm also on Instagram, TikTok, all that good stuff. So yeah, definitely a film that I gotta keep thinking about. Definitely gonna have more like realizations and whatnot when I edit this because I am again technically gonna be watching it again. So I will be seeing it and seeing just the overall of it again and i'll maybe things will be a little bit more clear but uh maybe not <laughs> anyway this was good trippy wild insane don't know fully exactly how to feel but i did enjoy it <laughs> i'm just dumbfounded so <laughs> again really do hope that you guys enjoyed the reaction and i hope to see you all in the next reaction video whatever that may be okie dokie toodaloo adios and goodbye Bye.
Oh, yeah.